Okay, here's the list. Top 10 bigs. You got Brooke Lopez, Jeremy Grant, Draymond Green, Kuzma, Vucevic, Pirtle, Harrison Barnes, Christian Wood, Rui, and P.J. Washington. Um, we talked about Brooke Lopez. Does he take a big bag to, to go to the Rockets, or does he take a longer-term bag to go with uh, Milwaukee? What's your prediction there? I think you go back to, for Brooke Lopez? Yeah. Just go back to the Bucks, man. I yeah. think you want to compete. Uh, I get why in the bag, but go back to the Bucks. Jay from PR says, Alex looks like Brooke Lopez. There's another one. Okay. Uh, Jeremy Grant. Jeremy Grant. He's looking for 30 bags. Is it Portland or is it elsewhere? I, I, I have a hard time calling this one. I have a hard time calling this one. It could be Portland. It still could be Portland, though. Uh, I think this will be this will be the domino that tells you if Dame's staying or not. If Jeremy Grant does not resign, mm. Dame's going to be out of there. Uh, I could see Portland doing that. Mm. Once again, who's the next guy that come to come through? That's 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 my question. I I don't know where else Jeremy Grant would have a suitor to make thirty million. Yeah. I don't even see the Rockets even doing an idea like that because you got Jabari out there and he needs to get minutes. True. True indeed, man. Uh, Draymond, I mean, you have the Sacramento rumors with Mike Brown. I don't see it. They're, say, they're saying that Dame wants the Blazers to sign Draymond Green to do what exactly? Draymond Green is staying with the Golden State Warriors, man. There, there's no chance. That they just got rid of Jordan Poole. <laughs> they just got rid of Jordan Poole. Problem solved. They got CP3. Draymond is like, I don't see anything else making sense, man. Draymond, he already said he wants to go out. He came in with Steph and Clay, so to speak. He wants to go out with Steph and Clay, and I don't see that changing anytime soon, man. Draymond's staying with the Warriors, bro. Um, Kuzma, we talked about Kuzma's got options. Could it be Detroit? Could it be Sacramento? Kuzma's got options, and we'll have to see what happens on Friday. Uh, what, what's your prediction for Kuzma? I think Sacramento uh, would be it. Um, yeah, I, I yeah. can see Sacramento being the move for him. Vucevic, I think this is Bulls. I think Vucevic is Bulls. Man. You can't let him go. You can't if let you're him the go. Bulls. Yeah, you can't. You just traded. He's got him by the balls. You got to pay the guy now. You just traded all those assets for him, and now you're gonna say, "Yeah, man, it's okay. You walk." And then you're really gonna. If that happens, there's no way you're gonna tell me you have yeah. leverage. Then, like a lot of leverage to make a, a Zach Levine trade. Right. Right. Um, Jakob Pertl, I think he stays with the Raptors. The original pick of the Raptors uh, goes to the Spurs in the Kawhi Leonard deal, then gets traded for back to the Raptors. I think Ujiri keeps him there. He's a good setter, man. He's developing a good career for himself. Good defender. Yeah. Um, and, and somebody that the Raptors really needed, and, and they were able to get him at the trade that line. I have to think that they keep him there and continue to push forward with Siakam and OG and... And uh, and Trent Jr. maybe fire Van Fleet. I think uh, Jakob Pertl stays with the uh, Raptors. Your thoughts? Yeah, I spoke to William Wu when I did the Raptors Knicks uh, game of the week preview for Knicks Fan TV. Yep. For any of those, for any of you new viewers who do not know about that channel, make sure to go over there and subscribe. Um, but talked about with William Wu, he said they really need a center. I think they keep him. I get the whole. Why everyone to be six nine, but you still need a center in this league. Yeah. So I think he stays. I agree. Uh Harrison Barnes has talked that the Pacers are interested. Look, I thought he had a pretty decent uh did a pretty decent job with the Kings. Yeah. You know, Harrison Barnes right now will be just a, a journeyman uh veteran that can, you know, help plug a few holes for teams, but for other teams like the Kings, you, you look to make an upgrade there uh for some better talent. But overall, Harrison Barnes has certainly carved out a good career for himself. Christian Wood. There's no telling. Dallas obviously retooled by getting Derek Lively from the uh, in the draft. Now, there's still yeah. talks that they're trying to reopen that window to get Aiton over there in Dallas. But either way, it looks like Christian Wood. I don't know. I, I don't know what the prospects, the free agent prospects are for Christian Wood, but we'll have to wait and see, man. Yeah, and <sighs> to, talking to with our guy Bibbs when I also did uh, the uh, game of the week preview for Knicks versus the Dallas Mavericks. He, he was very confused on the utilization of Christian Wood mm -hmm. based on Jason Kidd's coaching. So not sure if Christian Wood himself would be happy to go back to Dallas uh, after how, I guess, 
how he felt, how he should have been utilized. So it'll be interesting to see where Christian Wood goes this free agency. Yeah, no, no question about it. And then uh, we did talk about Rui. I, I think it's it's a Lakers move for Rui. Yep, who was able to bounce back strong. So uh, let, let's see what happens there. PJ Washington, uh, not clear what his prospects are. He's probably you know a, a late free agency decision by any team, but he's got to get the bag. He owes a lot in child support, man. He's got to get the bag. So whoever you know picks up PJ, make, make sure to take care of him, man. Yeah, and uh, just quick honorable mentions: Grant Williams, not sure what the Celtics do there. Yeah, Mason Plumley, decent center. Jalen McDaniels, another power forward who is on the Philadelphia 76ers. You know, if you want a three and D, mostly a defensive guy at the power forward position, those are some names out there as well uh, that teams would probably be looking at. Yeah, Plumley did well for the Clippers, man. Plumley did very well for the Clippers. Hey, maybe he's an option for the Lakers. You know, it gives give them some depth, give them some big man help. I thought he played well for yeah. the Clippers, man. 